Governor McMaster recently signed a bill that opened up hemp pilot programs in the state. It also gives more farmers the ability to grow hemp and make it the next big cash crop. News 13's Julie Calhoun is taking a closer look at the new law and what potential growers need to know. The law removed stipulations for hemp pilot and research programs, which limited the number of people who could grow and the number of acres they could grow on, which is huge for the state's agricultural industry. But that doesn't mean anyone can just start growing hemp. Now the 162 people who applied for the state's hemp program last year can start to grow. That's only they pass a background check and have not been convicted of a felony relating to a controlled substance in the past 10 years. To be able to grow hemp in South Carolina, you must apply for a permit through the State Department of Agriculture and give them your GPS coordinates of where the crop is being grown. Industrial hemp is used in food, clothing, and even door panels on BMWs made here in South Carolina. Most of the states are registering it as uh, the next big tobacco in a way. Um, you know, tobacco prices have gone down and, you know, hemp's a lot healthier for you too. While some restrictions are taken away, the law has made clear regulations on what hemp products someone can sell. You can sell things like cosmetics, food, and fibers containing hemp, but not unprocessed raw plant material or hemp seeds, something Ralph has seen being sold in our area. Ralph, the owner of Palmetto Harmony, says previously there was no real definition on if you can sell a hemp bud, but says since the law is so new, she wants to make sure other business owners are aware. What will happen is eventually SLED is going to come in and they're going to start shutting your operations down and you're risking your whole livelihood and your storefront and even jail time. We'll put a link to where you can read that entire law for yourself at WBTW.com. Reporting in Conway for News 13, I'm Julie Calhoun.